Good morning, everybody. We got to get her milked, get them fed, and turn the chickens loose. So here we go. One of these days, somebody's going to feel sorry for me and get me one of them automated chicken doors. <laughs> got it. Now let's go milk. And y'all, look who's with me today. My cameraman. <laughs> Hello, y'all. How you doing? I'm Todd. Well, we're getting ready to film, milk, do all the stuff. Let's see if I can help her out a little bit. I'll be the cameraman, help her out. Yeah. I'm going to let her do the work. Mm -hmm. Let's, Let's see go. what happens. Let's go. Good morning. Hi, Butterfly. Hi, Willow. Hi, Gyro. Hi, Will. What's your matter about? Peachy, get your rump back in there with the other goats. <laughs> These babies, you gotta fool them. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. They're getting smart, they're getting smart. Will, cause she comes every morning. She'll come check this. So I gotta shut this to lock everybody up in here so they don't get out when I milk butterfly. And look how they got it piled down. Look how that's just breaking down, y'all. Can y'all see that? Look at that. All this is just breaking down. I'm gonna be digging all that out of here soon. And yeah, I know, I probably shouldn't have to lock it, but, oh, Willow's in here, so yeah, you gotta lock it. Look here, this morning, see him? Bad, bad, watch him, watch him. See him, see him? Dang it, kicked. Dang, he hurt me. Does he got spurs or something? <laughs> All right, guys, I need to show y'all this colony extension over here. What's going on? All right, see down in the bottom there? There's a trap door. This is the rabbit colony. There's the trap door. That is a pipe that runs underneath this walkway that goes across to this other pasture. Okay, that pipe comes across and comes into the rabbit extension that's where the greens are now I'm fixing to open that door up and let them in there see if they can knock some of them greens down Jerry's got the pheasant flying around over there Good morning, 
All right, y'all. Now the rabbits can go in there and eat. I'll leave them in there a couple days and shut it back off. Good old Mr. Rooster. I can remember he took off. He just don't like Jerry. Come on, girls. Come on, precious. Guys, this is precious right here. I bottle fed her. I was going to, had to drive an hour and something to my niece to go to nursing school in the morning times. I'd get up early in the morning time to feed her. And she'd be out, little old bitty calf, and she'd be by herself, I'd holler, precious, I got meal, and she'd come running. We have a video and we'll put, uh, put it down in the uh, description. So check it out. And look at Precious, <laughs> how little she was. <laughs> it's not much, guys. We put hay and stuff out for them, but this is enough to keep them coming to the barn to where I can uh, control them, you know, have something to do with them. Okay guys, I got them fed. So now I got to go and uh, put Butterfly's food in her trough, then I'm gonna go feed the boys, and then I'll pick Butterfly up on the way back to the barn. So come on. All right guys, when I first got Butterfly, I had a problem of her eating all the food real quick, and I wasn't done milking. So I learned a new trick. So she gets two scoops of her food. And then I put alfalfa hay on top. <laughs> so that slows her down and I'm able to milk and get that done before she finishes eating. on top and that slows her little self down. Now come on, let's go. <laughs> hey guys, I don't know if y'all know the difference, but that's Junior over there. This white one is not Junior. He has no name, but if you look at his tail feathers, where it looks like something got a hold of him. Well, it did, because I had to come out here. This male duck that we have, I don't know where he's at, he flies in and out, but the male duck was jumping on this turkey and was hung on to him, child. Feathers and everything. I had to go and get this duck off this turkey, people. So, I don't know what the turkey did to the duck, but he ain't gonna mess with him no more. The Muscovy is the boss. Yes. So let's go get, uh, feed the boys. Come on, guys. We're going to feed the boys. Yeah, I, I'm a, I go down here in the morning times and I feed them, then I pick her up on the way back through. And uh, she normally follows me, look at her running. She'll follow me all the way down. Watch her. <laughs> While I go feed the boys. And then she waits. She knows her pickups when we come back. Hi, girl. thing but this is little buddy here this is badger this is my herd sire right here and uh this is sequoia uh the only doe he got to breed this year was doris because doris is not registered and so buddy's not registered either but he wasn't old enough to breed anything but come on let's go and get uh but buddy hey 
He's up for grabs if you want him. Anybody wants little buddy? He's not a registered buck. But uh, he has pretty babies. <laughs> Badger is Buddy's daddy. And uh, Buddy is little. Lippy is his sister. Doris is his mama. So if anybody's interested in Buddy, let me know. So let's go get Butterfly. I've got a little bit of uh, antibacterial soap and I got some betadine in this water. So I'm gonna wash her uh, udder real good. Hey guys, I appreciate y'all coming along with me feeding. My hat's probably crooked. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and get her milked on out and bring the milk in the house. And I appreciate y'all and I thank y'all and God bless.